Hello YouTube, this is Dragonheart and welcome to my YouTube channel and welcome to Empire Total War, the Maratha Confederacy campaign. And before we start, I do have a shout out and that is to the Juiced 300. His link will be in the description. This guy is awesome. He made me a, an outro for my YouTube channel. Hopefully if things go right in the editing process, it will be at the end of this video. But um, yeah, thank you to the Juice 300. Very, very thoughtful of him. Very, very great for him to do such a thing. So go and check his channel out. Link is in the description. And he's awesome. So let's go on with this campaign. Here we are on the campaign map. And we're starting to kick on with this campaign now. We're doing pretty well for ourselves. We've got an army here. But we're starting to muster an army here, I should say. But we've got to try and keep this population happy, so... Just looking around to see what forces, what troops I can probably muster at some of these forces. I want to go north and try and take this guy out of here, this army. Um, Hinduism is being spread. That's good. We're recruiting there, that's good. Just, just on a quick check before I end turn, just to see where I am with everything, because I do get a bit lost sometimes when I go between each turn. Got one new year. I'm not too bothered about leaving this place undefended because I'm not gonna be striking for anybody at the moment. The one thing I do probably need is a navy, but the problem is I oh I have got one port. Can I recruit anybody? Oh, I've got enough money. Okay we'll end turn and we'll see what happens this turn now. So yeah go and check out uh the Juice three hundred. Check his channel out Go on his videos, leave him a comment, let him know the dragon heart sends him. <laughs> Something like that. Um, I should probably give you guys a, a nickname, I suppose. Most um, YouTubers, they have some sort of name they associate with their audience. PewDiePie, he calls them the bros. I think Lionheart, with regard to Total War, I think Lionheart, he calls them... Or he's trying to get to call them his cubs or his cublets or something like that. So, um, what could I call you guys? Um, my minions? Um, I don't know. Maybe not. The Dragonites? The Hearts? I don't know. I'll tell you what, let me know in the comments what I should call you guys. Maybe we'll all agree on something. Because <laughs> um, for now, I'm, I'm just calling you you guys, and it's a bit lame, so. I wouldn't mind getting a kind of something I can associate you guys with. And you see what I just did here? I called you you guys again. So we are recruiting in this province. We could do with some cannons in this province, so guns or cannons, we'll go with the can the cannons. We're gonna go we're gonna spam cannons basically and we're going to get some line infantry. That's one thing I am lacking on, is line infantry. We're gonna make a big push. I've got one unit here. I can spare this unit probably. You can go north. Link up with this province. I'm just trying to bolster all my northern forces now, basically. I'm probably focusing too much on uh, cannons though, but they are a game changer in this game. If you got some cannon, it will work in your favour. As you've seen in some of my battles before. Don't oh, mob. I have another horseman there. So these next few turns are going to be a bit boring basically, it's just going to be me going through the the campaign map and sort of bolstering all my provinces, making sure I've got units coming in, making sure I've got the right buildings. I will have a little look at my tech after this end turn phase to see how things are going. But I think things are going quite well at the moment with this campaign. I think in the last video I had a look and I think it's 15, maybe 16 provinces that I need to win this campaign. So it's basically all of India. I take out the Mughals, I take out uh, the southern provinces, which are against me, Portugal and the United Provinces. And I've pretty much won the campaign, so all I've got to focus on is the one theatre of war, which is something which I enjoy, because the one thing with Empire I don't like is if you pick like Great Britain or France, or even the United Provinces. They have they're in two or three theatres of war and I, I just find it so hard to multitask. I mean, 
don't get me wrong, I love Total War, but the kind of micromanaging of the game, it can get a bit too much on occasion, and I find that especially with Empire. They have tried to dumb it down a little bit in the latest Total War game, Shogun 2, and looks like they have for Rome 2 as well. So we're just going to wait and see, but it's one of the things which does the loads of troops there now. I wouldn't mind some camel gunners, missile cavalry, that'd be nice. Camelry, I should say. Got a small force here, which will go north. Probably will have a battle in this uh, part as well. I do try to get a battle in whenever I can. Uh, get these guys in now. Just gonna have to bolster this army, I think. We got. Oh, we have got a couple of troops coming in. We're doing quite well financially as well. We are doing really well financially. These guys don't like me. Probably need to build something to make them happy. I'll go with that. Right, so we're doing well now, doing pretty pretty okay. What have we got here? With militia. I want some camelry. Some line infantry would be nice. Um I'll get some more camels. They are useful. And this force. Just a navy there. I could go for the navy. I'm gonna no I'm gonna go and attack the navy. I felt like it. There we are. I've taken the navy, and we can take them as well. I'm sure we can. Surely. Make sure we got some units being recruited. Got loads of units being recruited here. Have loads of cannon, which I'll take here, and then take north with me. So we'll end turn again. It's a little bit boring at the moment. I do apologise for that, but I'm just currently bolstering my forces, making sure that I'm going to be strong for the next few turns. Because the Mughal Empire are quite weak in this campaign, as you can probably tell. The only thing that I do find with the Mughals, they are a bit relentless. They do send loads and loads of smaller stack armies to kind of disrupt your movements. They, they attack your navies, if you, as you've previously seen in some of the videos. They do attack your, your farms and some of your buildings. And it is a little bit irritating, so you've got to take all them out first before you can actually proceed properly with the campaign. Portugal. Ooh, this looks like Portugal attacking Mysore. That'd be interesting. Will the Portuguese attack Mysore? Well, let's have a look. So, where are we? New Royal Air. Okay. No problem. Recruitment. Loads of units. We will be attacking this turn, I think. I do want to check something quickly. Portugal. Where are they? Portugal, Portugal, Portugal. They are at war with my zone. Oh, so... <laughs> I am half tempted to pick a side. I'm allied with my zone. I'm not allied with Portugal. It is tempting to go and try and take that, but then I might... Nah, I'll leave them for now. Let them fight to their own devices, and then... Then I think we'll go forward and attack. we got loads of cannon in this army as well. These guys... They're going to go and attack. We're going to try and take this province this turn, I think, this episode. I could demand surrender, but I'd rather fight. I'm in the mood for a battle, and I think you guys deserve a battle as well. So here I am, giving you a battle in Empire Total War now, in this part. I think it's part... I think it's part 10 this is now. I hope I'm right. If not, I do apologise. I do get a little bit sidetracked when it comes to remembering which episode I'm on. But I'm not too bad, usually I'm only an episode out if I am wrong. And I think it's 23 days now till Rome. Can't wait for Rome to be released. As I've mentioned so many times now, you're probably sick of me reminding you in each video how many days. I think in my last video a couple of days ago, I said it was only like uh, 24 days until it's, out, until it's released and I was, I'm saying it's 23 days. Ooh, got some high ground over here. I think we could exploit this with the unit of cannons. And then we have one more unit of cannons, which I think I'll probably keep in the center. Probably about there. What's the ground like? Yeah, it's pretty flat. It's not too bad. Um, right, so we need my infantry. All you guys are going to be grouped. Single line. I'm just going to go with that to begin with. We do have our camels on the flanks. 
get my cannons and start firing. Oh, they're out of range, that's not fair. I thought they'd be in range. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Okay, that's bad. And they're not in range either. I've put them too far away. I'm such an idiot. Right. Can I move them? No, I can't move them even. Can I get out the fire at least? They just fixed. That's stupid. They just fixed. Come on now. I need you guys to start firing for me. Anytime now, please. Start firing. Here we go. Get those guns going. That's what I want. Take those camels out. There we go. Brilliant. So far, so good. Taking quite a lot of those camels out and they are starting to rout. Oh, I see a cheeky flank. No, you don't. No, you don't. Just noticed last minute. Last minute today, they starting to flank me. We'll dive straight into my camels. Take out their camels. Left flank can move up as well. Take out the armed populace. Shouldn't be any match for my camels. The line's doing well so far. This is going to be a pretty easy battle, I think. I'm actually surprised myself at the moment how well this battle's going. <laughs> Two units routed in the first minute. Must be a record for me. I'm not usually this good. Right. Keep attacking. Come on. Murder them. Absolutely annihilate. Oh, look at this shooting by you in the middle. That's right. Get as many shots away as you can, please. Get a nice little end zoom for you guys. To see the action. Look at that. Lovely wrist action there. And I am being slightly dirty at the moment. I do apologise. <laughs> and they're routing. Look at this. They're all routing. Well, most of them are. They're wavering. Camels. Do your duty and start attacking. Left these guys a little bit ended. They are losing slightly. We're doing okay. guys around. Hopefully they'll start routing soon. This battle will then be over then. Come on, let's defeat these Mughals. This is an important battle. You can see in the horizon there's the city. That's what we're going to take. If I get a little end zoom, that's the target over there. The city. I can't remember what the city was called though. <laughs> I should probably have checked that but oh well, these things do happen. They're out in, they're wavering, I'm going to turn these camels around so I can see them coming back. Oh, I've lost camels over here, it's not good. Probably a little bit overconfident by me, I do apologise. Bring these two up, get them running up as well. And my camels can give a charge now. Here we go. Get a little bit of action now. There we go. A little bit of a camel charge. Camel cam. Camel camera. Oh, look at this. Look at what I'm doing there. Messed up my camera a little bit. But we're doing okay. We're routing them. We're making them break. And I've invented a new camera type in the process. The camera cam. <laughs> Rome 2 Total War has got the unit cam. I have the camel cam. And I'm acting like a complete dick at the moment. Oh god, what's happening here? Right, get you guys to fire. I've lost my camels on this right flank. My cannons are able to fire on this unit. Need to get these guys to fire in as quickly as possible. These guys can probably support. Go for the right flank. And these guys can team up on this unit. This battle should be over pretty soon. Doing okay so far, not too bad. Lost two units of camels, that's all. Switch to melee. Actually, I shouldn't have done that. Oh, it's okay, musketeers, we go. I think we'll be alright. Switch to melee for these units as well. Take them out. We haven't got a lot, an awful lot left now. They're out in, they're shattered. Let's bring the camels in. If I will zoom out a minute at the battlefield so we have my two units routed in on the right flank. My, my cannons are no good over there. 
these cannons are probably not much good over here either. Same with these. They're just firing up now to try and take the routing units out. But it looks like that's pretty much the battle. These guys are holding on just about, but that's going to be over soon. My camels are charging in. In melee, and they are routing. They are broken. Looks like we have won the day here. Oh, and we've killed their general in the process just before the end of the battle. And there we are. So we'll end the battle there. Heroic victory. And looks like we've taken another province in this war against the Mughal Empire. So there we are. Another province is ours. Region captured. And the region is called Gujarat. I hope I pronounced that right. If not, I do apologise. But I am a bit of a dick. And... We'll repair these places. I'll build some roads for you guys as well. I've got a fairly strong force. I've got a uh, spy which I'm going to bring over to this region. Just have a little look what they got here. What sort of army they got. I think I've got two. I, I, could actually, I wonder if I could do this turn. I don't think I've got enough units. No, I'm going to have movement points. But next turn I can go there and take that province. But I'm going to end the episode there. So it's been a successful episode. Uh, we've taken another province in this campaign. Go and check out uh, the Juice 300. Uh, great YouTuber. Help me make this uh, video, which hopefully you'll see at the end of this video if everything goes well. But thank you for watching. I've been Dragonheart, and until next time, goodbye. <laughs>